Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatu wa barakatu. Takomi sot në impact me dy të ftuar të veçant, me dy të ftuar që kanë uh, bërë një histori në një përpjekje shumë të madhe për të gjetur vajzën e tyre. Janë uh, shumë të veçant, pasi ata janë dy shtetas kanades me origin iraniane, të cilët kanë humbur vajzën e tyre si pasoj e rekrutimit të saj nga organizata uh, ish terroriste, uh, MEC, ose Mujahidin e Lehat, që tashma aktualisht ndodhet në Shqipëri. Se qëfar nga mbërë këta zotëri, uh, për pjekjet e tyre uh, duke filluar prej vitësh me kërkime për ta gjetur dhe për ta shpëtuar vajzën e tyre, duke uh, filluar që në Frans, në Paris, ku me ku në filim kishte, apo kjo organizat në filim kishte, uh, seline saj kërësore dhe qëfar ju ndodhja tje, qëfar hoqën atje, uh, sulmet e kësaj organizate të shumë fishta, her të hapura dhe her të fshehura, akuzat e kësaj organizate për këta dy prinder të gjarë, të cilët thjesht kërkojnë vajzën e tyre, uh, akuzat si agent i ramjan, apo uh, akuzat si kur uh, Këta duan ta shkëpusin vajzën e tyre nga zgjedhja që ajo ka bërë, kujtojnë se kjo vajz është kapu nga kjo organizat vetën në moshën një mëdhjet vjeqare, pra kur ajo ishte ende e mitur. Se si filloj kjo histori, uh, pse ajo akoma ndodhet aty, pse kjo organizat i pengon këta prinder të takojnë vajzën e tyre, cili është roli i shtetit shqiptarë. Sa po indimojnë strukturat kompetente uh, këto dy prinder për të gjetur vajzën e tyre? Shfar bëjnë aktualisht në Shqipëri? Uh, si njoha unë si uh, në rolin e avokatës në fakt, këto dy persona, akuzat dhe sulmet që më, po më bëjnë edhe mua personalisht si shtetas e shqiptare e këti vëndi, nga disa persona uh, si që është kjo organizat, e cilas duhet ishte fare në vëndin tim, jo vetëm që më ka zënë vëndin tim, jo vetëm që po më merë 10 hektar për një kamp ushtarak që po ndërton, jo vetëm që po shkel haptas të drejtat e njëri u gjithë dit, duke mbajtur peng mira persona të cilët duan të largohen nga këtë grup, ju kujtojmë se deri ta një largua rreth 400 vetë nga këtë grup, Dhe kjo organizat, për të mos u mjaftuar me surmet e brëndshme, ndaj antarve të saj, ndaj familjarve të këtyre antarve, të cilët duan të shpëtojnë familjarët e tyre që janë brënda në organizatë në banë pen, nuk mjaftohet me kajsh, por më surmon edhe mua si shtetas e shqiptare, si avokate e këtyre personat, të cilët dua si e shtindimoj në kuadrë njërzor për të arritur qëlimin e tyre human që është familia. Atëherë, për të mosu zgjatur më shumë, unë do t'ju prezentoj edhe me pashaportat e tyre kanadeze, pra ju kujtoj që janë shtetas kanadas, është me mua zodi Mustafa, <coughs> tu kemi edhe pashaportën e ti, bisetu në do t'a zhvillojmë në anglisht, uh, welcome Mr. Mustafa, uh-huh. Dhe gjithashtu, uh, gruaja e ti, uh, Zonja Robabe ose Mahbube, welcome. You are uh, well known as Mahbube, yeah? Yes, it is. Yeah. So, uh, I uh, presented in Albanian language that you have done a long way to find your daughter. Thank so, you. So, let's start from the beginning. So, your name is... Uh, Mustafa Mohammadi. Yeah. I am father of Somaya Mohammadi. I am a Canadian citizenship. Yeah. And your wife? Mahbube Hamze is mother Somaye Muhammadi. Uh, so your daughter name is uh, Sumeya Muhammadi. Sumeya Muhammadi. Uh, what is her age? Uh, now that she, we are talking. Uh, now is uh, uh, 36 years old, but she was 16 years uh, old. Uh, she went to Iraq, Canada to Iraq. So, you were living in Canada since when? Uh, we, uh, we went to Canada in uh, 1994, we went to Canada. And your family, your children, you have how many children? I have uh, four uh, children and two boys, two girls. Two boys and two girls. Two so, you don't have any connection with this organization, nothing. You just went in Canada to have a better life there? Yes. 
and you started a life in Canada. That's right. uh, what was the reason that uh, your daughter and first even your son were in contact with Mac, with this organization? <clears throat> Because we came out of Iran for political and refugee, we came out of Iran, uh, we went to Turkish, we live in the Turkish 18 months, After 18 months, uh, we came to Canada. We live in the Canada. Yeah, and you went with your children there. Yes, me you and my there. wife and my four kids. We went in the live in the Canada. Yeah, and uh, I remember that her sister or her brother was with Mac or not? Uh, who? Yes, because uh, her brother was a uh, mujahid uh, before revolution in short time. Was in the Which year? Uh, I don't know English uh, <laughs> time, but is a uh, Iranian is a uh, like 62, yeah? yeah, 1962. 1962. No. Uh, 1962. Uh, 1962. Uh, in Iranian. Uh, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> so you you imagine that this organization is a democratic organization. What is your opinion about this organization? Before, that time. Uh, yeah. Before that time, uh, I believe uh, with Mujahideen Khar because I know the Mujahideen Khar uh, they do uh, they want to do a democratic. Uh, See, to change the regime the, and to put a democratic, uh, democratic regime. regime. Are they recruiting people in Canada? Uh, the uh, Mujahideen uh, Canada, uh, we went to uh, Canada and meet uh, the Mujahideen Khaq was there and the, uh, they had demonstration or something that one. They take us to the, uh, that demonstration against the Mullah regime or Khomeini regime. Mm -hmm. So, uh, why they or how your children got in touch with this organization? Really, I want to tell you, uh, I believe the Mujahideen Khaq before uh, is a revolution Shah Tam uh, and after the Khomeini regime, I believe the Mujahideen Khaq. But we went to the, in the Canada, the member Mujahideen was there, they come in, talking with me and my family. But slowly, slowly, we're going to uh, house in the Mujahideen they have in the Toronto. Mm -hmm. But uh, meet them and talking with them uh, and show some movie to us mm -hmm. in the Camp Ashraf inside the Iraq. Mm -hmm. But my wife's sister before went to Iraq and And uh, that time is a uh, war uh, in the uh, Mujahideen with uh, uh, Iran uh, and Farooq Javidan or Mersad, they said. And uh, her sister is uh, Mujahideen uh, executed. After, tell us the Mullah regime executed uh, my mm -hmm. sister's wife. But, That time, I was be thinking Mujahideen goes in Iran, they bring it to democracy. And uh, me and uh, Somaye, uh, we work in, uh, with Mujahideen, knock the door, make it some uh, money, help for Mujahideen group. Getting some funding uh, yeah. for the organization, organization in Canada. In the Canada. On yeah, the because Toronto. you believe that this organization is a democratic one. Uh, yes. And they told you that the Iranian regime uh, killed uh, the, her sister. Her sister, yeah. So and, you believe that kill, you are doing the right thing, yeah? That's right. And uh, kill uh, brother. Her, and, and her brother too. Her brother. Uh, He was killed. Yeah, killed. It's how many regime that killed it? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. So you decided to go then in Iraq? I am not uh, go to Iraq, but. We work in uh, to Mujahideen uh, help make it money and uh, donation. Yeah, your daughter is always with you. Yeah, but um, so uh, you can take care of her. Yeah, my daughter was uh, with me because uh, that time uh, I cannot speak uh, English, but my daughter is younger. She's helping you. Yeah, helping me. We were with going knock the door. Please, you help uh, for the kids. Yeah. That time uh, uh, we have some picture uh, for. 
kids uh, live in the tents and uh, on the mountain. But we showed uh, that picture. Look, these children need money and medicine and tents. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, yeah. But uh, the people believe uh, to us, they give us some money, but uh, we give it, uh, that money all of them to uh, organization Mujahideen mm Khalq. -hmm. Uh, and you, in meantime, you, you uh, support your husband and your daughter to do this work in Canada, yeah? Yes. Yeah. And how she got involved in the organization? Because she was no, a kid. Yeah, she was, uh, that time. How she they was, took it from you? Because yeah. you are always together. Yeah. She was, uh, uh, that time we started, she was uh, 14 years old. Yeah, but 14 after years old. 14, uh, yeah. But after two years, uh, we working to Mujahideen, uh, they come in 16, close to 17 years old. But uh, Mujahideen, member Mujahideen uh, in the Toronto. Yeah. They're talking uh, with Somaya. Mm -hmm. She's a member uh, Marzi Salehi. Uh, was uh, in uh, in Toronto uh, in the Toronto yeah uh, talking with Somaya Somaya um, was best friend uh, your aunt mm -hmm. but uh, Somaya they have good memory f for aunt yeah she is feeling nostalgic uh, and this uh, thing. yeah but after the, they said uh, you wanted uh, you going to Iraq you see. Uh, many uh, cemetery, your aunt. Yeah. Uh -huh. But uh, she said yes. But she uh, asked me uh, uh, permission. Uh, uh, permission. Uh, we can go in the Iraq. But that time I believe to Mujahideen Khalq. I said okay, you can go. But Mujahideen they said for two weeks. So you have a ticket, two weeks. Going uh, I don't buy. No, I don't buy a ticket. The Mujahideen Khalq. The Mujahideen. You yeah. sold the ticket. Yes, I'm sure the ticket so for you are, two weeks. You are giving permission for your daughter only for two weeks. For two weeks. Did you sign any custody or something? Uh, because she's small. Yeah, I know. Uh, that time I don't did a sign. You didn't the, sign anything. Uh, that time no, but the ticket so my went to Iraq. Yeah. And after they come in, you are calling her meanwhile. No, I'm asking the Mujahideen. Yeah. Okay, why the... Uh, the uh, why Sumeya is not coming? Yeah, doesn't come in. They said they come in next month. Next month. Next month. I must be going to America, Washington, D.C. to have a uh, house, the uh, name is Piraish. But I must be going there. I'm asking the member of the Mujahideen. We want. They say, yeah, somebody they love there and they want to serve there, but she's. Uh, anything. But you cannot contact her. You cannot call Never. her. Never, no. Never. But, no. Only Mujahideen through them. Oh yeah, Mujahideen. Mm -hmm. But uh, they bring some uh, video. Yeah. The somebody show us. Uh, the somebody they say, oh, here is very nice. Or oh, I want to say here. She looks happy. Really. Uh, on the movie. Did you start doubting something or? You know, on the movie. But uh, that, uh, this is big mistake for me. Uh, I'm given the permission, my daughter goes to Iraq. But you didn't sign anything. No. no, no. But This um, is very strange because yeah. she cannot travel without a custody, without a permission signed you by you. Yeah, I don't need a sign, but uh, I want to tell you, but after, yeah. Uh, one year, uh, my uh, my son, uh, we look in the uh, Mujahideen, they take a, a small uh, children, 13 years, 14 years, 15 years, 16 years, from in the Canada and America. They take it like a youth or something? Yeah. They take it in the uh, Ashraf, Iraq. Iraq, in the Ashraf uh, city uh, in the uh, uh, Mujahideen. Yeah, in their camp. Yeah, uh, camp, Mujahideen. What they do there? They fight what they do? They are children. Or they uh, only train them? Uh, I'm sure you the uh, newspaper National Post. You know, in the National Post, I'm sure you yeah. uh, what they said. No, you just talk now for the public. Uh, yeah, I, know I know what you show me. Uh, and the, 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 uh, the uh, newspaper. Uh, the newspaper in the National Post, uh, 2006, 2023, uh, uh, September. Yeah. You can see uh, that uh, newspaper and show you everything. 
But uh, the ticket children and to camp Ashraf in, inside the Iraq. But my son just said, uh, Baba, Mama, uh, uh, you give it permit to me. I'm going there. To I'm, uh, I'm, uh, I'm going there. Uh, I'm watching this so my because I am kids, but I, I, I'm coming, but I am citizen Canada. I'm, I'm said, okay. Uh, What is his age? That time is, uh, he was uh, 15 years old. And he went to Iraq too? Yes. Uh, when? Uh, uh, Sumaya left? Uh, uh, 1997, uh, after one year, uh, uh, after uh, one year or something, months, uh, I can't remember exactly. But... Uh, uh, after, uh, how many months after Sumaya went? Uh, around, uh, after one year. After one year, after the one brother. Year, was, yeah, so you didn't you didn't understand that they are recruiting or radicalizing uh, Sumeya? Yeah, you know because uh, that time. Uh, you are just thinking that she's going to come. Children. This is the second mistake. So you made two mistakes. Two mistakes. Always with I'm the said, daughter, then mind. with the, the brother, son. yeah. But uh, the Muhammad goes in the Asha. But after that one. I'm asking what happened, why doesn't it come in my son? They, my son, they don't want to stay here. They told me, quiet. Don't now, talk. Now it's sad time. Uh, if you do it, anything, it uh, coming danger, uh, danger for uh, your family. It will be dangerous kids. for your family. Family. But uh, we think I'm talking my wife. What can I do? What so, do? Uh, if we compare now with ISIS, that is taking some children to recruit them and make them trained and brainwashed, is this the same what they did with Sumeya and your son? You know, that talk- Can we make this comparison? Because Albania doesn't know anything about MAC. They understand that this organization, like you, they, they think that this is a democratic organization. So, you have your experience. You have your son now That's home. That's right. Thank God. So, uh, what they did with your children, is this the same what is happening now in Syria and other countries? Uh, really, we came uh, here in the Albania country. Uh, we don't, uh, that time we don't know exactly if so many is here, but too many people uh, separate, uh, they came out of Mujahideen. Uh, on the Facebook, uh, they told me so my in the Albania, but uh, we came out in the Albania. No, just ask, answer to me the question: When she was a child with her brother, yeah. was she radicalized from this organization in Iraq? Yeah. You think that yes. your your son told you what they did with him? Yeah, my son that uh, and uh, my son and my uh, so my. Yeah. That time we went, at me and my wife and two kids, we went to see, they said, it is quiet. When, when you go to Iraq? Exactly two weeks before America attacked to Iraq. Which year? Uh, 2003. 2003. So you waited for how many years? Oh, uh, ten, uh, six years. For six years, you 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 no, waited. Nineteen ninety seven to two thousand three, we went there. Uh, so you waited for the organization to bring back your children. Yes. They didn't bring. Not so yet. you traveled to Iraq to save your children. Yes. Yeah. But, uh, what you what you saw there? What happened with you there in Iraq? You know, I'm did too much try. I'm going to Iraq. In certain time, nobody they cannot go inside the uh, camp. Iraq. Inside the, the Iraq. Even in Iraq, yeah. Even in Iraq, uh, until to, you going to Camp Asha. Mujahideen always they told me, okay, next month, six months after, five months after. They keep lying on you. Uh, always lying. Always lying to us. But we cannot do anything. We don't know what we're doing. The Mujahideen that told us, if you do it, anything is very a big problem, you make it for your kids, uh, Muhammad and yeah, Soma. Yeah. But I have thought it, but we don't know anything. Anyway, you went to Iraq in the, when America attacked Iraq, yeah. and so you feel safe because as Canadian citizens, That's right. you think that America is going to help you now. That's right. Okay, did they help you? Uh, America, uh, yes, uh, they did uh, help me. I went uh, five times inside the camp. 
Yeah. Uh, you were with your wife? Oh uh, yes, uh, me and my wife uh, three times, and uh, uh, two times I um, went to work. Uh, five times I went, to, but she went to the inside three times. Inside the camp. Inside the camp. And did you uh, uh, let her talk a bit, so you rest a bit? Uh, uh, did you have the, the possibility to meet your children when you went in Iraq? Yes. They let you see them? Yes. Yeah, and what, what did you see? My daughter and my son in the Baghdad. Yeah, in Iraq. what they do there? Uh, Nothing. They're wearing like soldiers. They have guns yes, and like, these yeah, things. Like, yeah, before is have a soldier, uh, have a gun, everything, and the America is going there. Yeah, the, all the gun is take it from America, take it. And they are in that camp there, yeah. and yeah. they just stay and wait yes. for some safe place. Yes. And uh, the Mujahideen is letting you to to meet your your children there. Or uh, yeah. yeah, yeah, and yeah, your I'm children, to they Iraq want to they come are... out uh, no. from yeah. the group? My children is very scared. They said, is no, don't, don't talk about that. Because uh, so many times I ask, so many, Muhammad, you want to come in? They said, no, no talk. Don't talk. They are yeah. afraid. They are yeah, scared. They are afraid. Yes. Uh, Muhammad was 15 years old. And, uh, but when you meet him in Iraq, what's his age? Oh, we went to the uh, Somalia in 1997 to 2000. 20 years old, the Somalia, and the 19 years old, the uh, Muhammad. Wow. Yeah. That and they are scared, they are too, uh, too scared. Somalia is scared. scared. My, my son, Muhammad, is all the time is nervous, shaking. shaking, shaking the body. When I sit here, it's fast shaking. Like yeah? Yes, like Until that. Until now. Until now. Until now. The now. shake is... Uh, if you see my son, I was the shaking. The, the he's body. talking about the Mujahideen. It's like the shaking is coming. So he, he's yeah. got a trauma, yeah? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's very bad. Then the son came out? Uh, 2000, uh, 2004. Four. How? Because uh, he, he was citizen. But uh, 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 she went to Jordan for uh, 45 uh, days. He did a salad, no food, eating uh, in the embassy side. The embassy Canadian, uh, they said, okay, we bring it, uh, Muhammad out. But uh, the uh, Muhammad, they came, but Sumaya, they cannot come in. Out. Because Sumaya was uh, a uh, minor age when she left and she didn't get the citizenship. Uh, citizenship, yeah. If the uh, Sumaya, because uh, Sumaya So didn't Canadian apply. government interfered so you can get your son out of the Mujahideen. That's right. Yeah, and the problem with Sumia is because she is not a uh, Canadian, Canadian citizen, citizen yes. because she left when she was minor, she didn't get the passport yet, and so they cannot interfere like this? That's right. Mm. Uh, what happened with your son? <clears throat> uh, my son... Uh, now when when he left the group oh um, uh, and came to canada now he's safe yeah. 2004. 2004. yeah what happened with him uh, what he's telling about this organization how they treated him oh you know that time uh, my son is muhammad uh, went to the iran is uh, five uh, years was in the mujahideen khan they came out of mujahideen uh, he was very uh, scared yeah. from the Mujahideen, always the same for mom and me. Uh, but he cannot sleep in. They said, uh, Mom, Mujahideen, they want to kill me, they want to kill me, no. they want to kill me. Or uh, they wanted uh, something to do it with my son. Yeah. Uh, always uh, he told us, in nighttime, uh, Muhammad, they cannot sleep in because he's sleeping. Yeah. Uh, on the bed, he cannot sleep. He's on the bed like that. He's staying sitting and not yeah. sleeping. Right time, yes. never. Never. And did you did you did you get uh, any psychologist to treat him? Yes. yes. Told me yes. that you two years. Yeah. For two years, for he's two being years. treated by a psychologist. Yeah. That's the doctor. Doctor, every <sighs> week, three times. Uh, his doctor is the doctor Azadian. Is a very good man and a good doctor. That talking too much with my son. And. Uh, 
I'm going to doctor because uh, me, I cannot sleep in. Now it's more than 20 years. I have big problem. I cannot see my daughter. Mm -hmm. uh, so if, if we imagine what they did to your son and what is his trauma and how he's suffering, how many years he stayed uh, in the five, organization? Uh, five years. Uh, Only five years. Uh, the, uh, now imagine uh, what happened to Sumeya that she is staying there longer. Uh, longer. So you look in it. Muhammad uh, is one citizen, but uh, he has uh, too much problem uh, until now. But that's so my event to Iraq. But you didn't stop old. your war or your fight to, to save your, your daughter. Huh? You didn't stop. Even that she is not a Canadian citizen, you went to Paris. You told me you went yes. to Paris. Why you went in Paris? What you did there? I went to Paris more than uh, 20 times. Yeah. I went to uh, Paris and 27 times I went to Iraq with my wife alone, with family, everybody. We went to you put your life in danger. You told me yeah. you have so yeah. many dangerous things. Oh my yeah, goodness. they tried bombing, bombing, and uh, did they try to kill you? Yes, the Mujahideen three times. They wanted to kill me and my wife. In the, uh, How you know that Mujahideen wanted to kill you? Oh, the, the Mujahideen uh, the first time we went to meet uh, American people. The American people they bring us uh, in the uh, after finish meeting uh, after four days. We was in the thief. Uh, in the American thief, we live yeah, there. Yeah. But the uh, American, they bring it on the door side, in the Ashraf side. Uh, we wanted came out uh, uh, here. Yeah. We wanted back home. The six people, the Mujahideen, all know, I know now all name. Uh, six people, they come in, follow us. Uh, we wanted to put inside the car and put the gun on my mind, uh, the, my head. They want to take it, uh, me. Uh, take it in, inside the car, uh, but uh, uh, me and my wife, uh, we stay there, but American looking for us, they come and help me. In Iraq, that's in the it? Iraq, in the and Iraq. then in Paris? Uh, in the Paris, two times uh, the Mojahideen, they hit me, uh, I'm sure, my picture, 2015 and 2016. Uh, 2015, me and my wife... Before and, three years? Yeah, three years. In uh, Paris, they... they there to, to attack you? Yes, I'm sure. In the that, middle of the city? I'm sure the documentary and picture, everything. The Mojahideen, uh, the, uh, attack me, hit me and my lawyer. Uh, uh, you had lawyer. a lawyer there? Yeah, I'm thinking. Should I be scared? <laughs> uh, I hit uh, my lawyer and my daughter, everything, the picture, I'm sure you. And uh, our documentary. You, you stayed in, in the hospital. hospital, yeah. Yeah. How many days you stayed in uh, the hospital? I'm, uh, I stayed in the hospital 24 hours. Uh, I said, uh, I am scared, I cannot... Uh, uh, so stay. you didn't accept to stay in hospital because yeah, you because are... because I am scared, because uh, Mujahideen, uh, they have money, they give us some uh, money for some group of people, they, they come in the hospital, they kill me, you know? Now you are in Albania, so yes. you, you finished in Iraq a battle, you saved your life so many times in Paris, now you came in Albania, why you came in Albania? Now I am understand my daughter uh, in the Albania and the Tirana. Who told you that your daughter is here? Uh, because uh, we asked a uh, uh, friend of uh, Somalia, they came out of... Uh, uh, out of the group? Yeah, out of in the group. Ah. They live in the, uh, Germany and uh, America, uh, the, the U.S. So the what, are, what the, are these posters? Uh, this poster is, uh, I'm sure, uh, this is... Uh, organization. This is, is your daughter, yeah? yeah yes, it's yeah. from my, uh, and uh, You made it in Albanian language, and yes. you are saying there that uh, this terrorist group, MKO, uh, has taken your daughter as a hostage, yeah? Yeah, because uh, now more than uh, 20 years, the Mojahedin doesn't give the permit to us. We look in my daughter. So you make these shirts too, with Albanian flag and yeah. with different with different uh, uh, texts and pictures, so you can uh, say to the people to, to come and help you and your cause, yeah? Yes. You have a blog even in internet, yeah? yeah? There are people from around the world helping you and you made so many TV programs, even in the famous CBS TV in Canada, you made a, a program, yeah? Yes. Uh, I Telling have your story and yes. Everything. Am I, I right? A, I have a, uh, news, uh, is a newspaper, National Post. 
It's five days. Uh, they give it uh, all my history. I have a documentary, uh, too many documentary in the On Iraq. YouTube? On uh, YouTube, everything they have it. So if we search your name or your daughter's Mustafa name, Muhammadi we, or Muhammadi or Muhammad Muhammadi. we can find so uh, many programs about program. the story. Yes. But it's interesting, you made it even with Albanian map. We can show the picture yeah, here. In yes. the back of the t-shirt too. Yeah, this is in the back of the t-shirt. This poster, yeah. 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 And this one, I have it. Yeah, yeah I have one like that here. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> because uh, I'm, uh, now I know my daughter is uh, live in the Tirana. So, uh, first were her friends that came out from this group that yes. told you that your daughter is in Albania. That's right. This is first uh, testimony. Yes. Then you came to Albania. That's right. Then you met here people that left the group and told that they saw your daughter. Like That's this? Right. That's right. Yeah. Uh, you went even to UNHCR. First day... What this organization did for you? Yeah. First day we came here. Yeah. Uh, they told me. When was that? Uh, when we came here? Uh, Thursday, two weeks ago. Two weeks exactly, ago. Exactly two yeah. weeks ago. Okay. Uh, uh, Friday day we went to the United National it's Commissar. UNHCR. Uh, yeah. yeah. We went there, but I'm asked. Uh, if your daughter is here in Albania. She is there. But I went there is uh, upon an. Uh, uh, Afghan uh, guy was there. Uh, he, his name is Ahad. And uh, what is this person Rafi. doing in this organization? What is his position? He's a director. Uh, this is, uh, they said they uh, help uh, for uh, refugee people and the uh, Mujahideen have They do it help. So he is responsible That's for possible, this yeah. group of people. And what did he say to you? Uh, I, I went there, uh, I asked them, um, uh, we came here, yeah. we uh, wanted to ask you, please help me, I want to, just, we want to see my daughter. But uh, we know my daughter. He said, yes, the, your daughter is uh, Albania. He confirmed yes. that yes. your daughter is here. Yes, yes. Did he give you any any paper, any document? They said that we cannot give it any paper to you because uh, it's not uh, legal. We give it any paper to you. They said like that. Yeah. After that, you went to Interior Ministry. Yes, uh, no. but he no. he told me you go to um, uh, ministry. our ministry, uh, ministry, yeah, to get the permission there. Yes, I went there. But uh, we give it a uh, name is Somaye Mohammadi. Yeah. Uh, that uh, is a misspelling or something wrong in her name. Yeah. No, because they, they registered in no. another name. Uh, uh, exactly, the Somaye name S O M. Yeah. But uh, in the Iraq, uh, they put the uh, Somaye uh, S A. Yeah. They, uh, but uh, I went to ministry. Uh, I'm asked uh, please that one. But he told uh, me is Mr. So called Shady. So called Shady. Yeah. So called Shady. Yeah. Yeah. This Albanian director. Yeah, director. Told you what? Uh, he said uh, just give Did it. Did you meet him? Yes. In uh, person. I mean, yes. But yeah. uh, he told me please give it to this time. I'm, uh, I'm looking. I'm going to search. Uh, about. Search. Uh, after I give it the answer to you. Two days, the coming 10 days. I cannot see him. I've, every day, every day, me and my wife, we went uh, in the ministry. We waiting. I be asking. Please, I want to uh, see. Uh, but always they said, oh, he has meeting. They cannot. Uh, He's come. busy always. Yeah, always. And he cannot uh, meet you. No. After uh, uh, 10 days, uh, uh, we uh, stay on the, the door side, yeah. but uh, we went to the inside, uh, he coming. He said... You saw him yeah, uh, coming, saw him. yeah. But uh, I'm asking, sir, what happened? You told me two days, now it's more than 10 days. I am worker. Uh, what happened? They said, uh, we did a search, we cannot find it in the... Somaya. Maybe Somaya is physically is here, but uh, we cannot find Somaya name on the computer. I said, what we can do? They said, I don't know, but uh, I cannot help you. My wife is too much crying. Yeah. That time is very bad day for us. 
He said, what can I do? Please you help me. I know my daughter is here. He said, your daughter is physically, maybe is here. But the name is not here. I said, please, you help me. They said, sorry, I cannot help you. Okay. But he's very sad. Uh, but how office. this organization, they told you it is, uh, she's it's here. here. Yes. But how they, come that our ministry is saying that is not here? But, it, these uh, two institutions, they are responsible for your daughter. That I, I went there. I'm asking, please, you give it the right name and so my uh, When they came here. Yeah. But he gave it, uh, the, uh, the name Somaya. We, we saw it. They did a mistake. Uh, exam is S A, not uh, S O. Somaya. Uh, you gave the, the right number, uh, yes. the right name to the uh, ministry. They didn't find it? Uh, but uh, he gave it to us. But uh, me and my wife, we back to ministry. I said, please. Uh, this name, maybe that name is not, but this name and this time Somaya came to Albania. You search. Don't answer to me. But I came, I'm looking, uh, I'm telling for my daughter in the Canada, please, you, f uh, you found any lawyer in the Albania, you search in the computer. But she told me uh, on the computer, found it, uh, some lawyer. But... Uh, my daughter is Mira, who is... Uh, the other daughter in Canada. Uh, in the Canada. Yeah. They said, uh, okay, uh, I'm found it, uh, that... Uh, uh, found it, your name. They said, uh, this is a uh, good lawyer because uh, always uh, he did uh, the help yeah, for we, another. We went uh, even to Brussels, even uh, to European <laughs> Parliament to, to help you and to present them what are they doing here in Albania and how human rights are being not respected by this group here yeah. in Albania. And you are a testimony, a, a, another <laughs> testimony. <laughs> uh, okay. I am, th uh, thanks God, because uh, my daughter uh, gave your telephone number, I'm call you, uh, we ask you, yeah, it is, we you help to... us. But, but tell me something else we, yeah. we forgot to mention. When you came in Albania, you told me that the police kept you in airport. Yes. First five time we came... Uh, let, let her talk. <laughs> okay, sorry. Buddy. Yeah, five hours I stay in the car. Uh, in the, in air, the airport. Albanian airport? Yes. Why? I ask Mustafa, uh, but why are you come here? Why are you here? And uh, Mustafa, they don't know. Is somebody exactly here? Yeah. You know, they said I wanted to go to the... How they know that you are coming for this purpose here? Uh, uh, can I tell you? Yeah. The Mujahideen, they give it my name. And, uh, to the police? The yes. police. Here immigration. In yes, uh, immigration. Yeah. Give it uh, my name and Hossein Nejad. Mr. Hossein Nejad uh, exactly sent me. But Hossein Nejad, 35 years, was a member of Mujahideen in the Arab. And he has a daughter, Dana Hossein Nejad, uh, exactly age of Somaye. And she's inside too? Uh, was. But was now, she get out? Yeah, she came out uh, around, I think, eight, uh, six or seven months ago. Yeah. Uh, yeah but uh, now, uh, I don't know. Uh, but so you think this organization is cooperating with our police and they yes. gave you, uh, your name to the, our police. Um, yes. And our police, once you, you came in Albania, uh, they catch you and they kept you for five hours in airport. In the airport. In yes. the airport. Yes. Then <coughs> what uh, happened? Then, uh, just uh, after uh, one week. Uh, no, after three days. After three days. Yes. Yeah, after uh, three days, you uh, are here in Albania. What happened? Albania. The police come in uh, my uh, hotel oh. site. Yeah, uh, Albanian a, police. Yeah, Albanian police. Exactly, uh, the police and another guy police was in the interview with me in, in the air, uh, airport. They came, he said, uh, hello. So Albania. they know they are uh, your hotel. Yeah, yes. And they are coming your hotel. Uh, 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 they asked, uh, before I wanted to enter uh, to uh, Tirana, uh, he asked me, you did a reception in the hotel? I said, yeah, this is a reception in my hotel, mm -hmm. uh, this is my ticket. So everything. they come disturbing you in your hotel. Uh, yeah. 
Did they have any mandatory or nothing. any document? Nothing. nothing. Doesn't show Just anything. knocking in the door and... Uh, on the door side? Outside, yeah. Outside. Uh, yeah. We in came the hallway, out. yeah. yeah uh, he came in, they said, oh, uh, you come in uh, with us, we're going to police, uh, police station. We said, why are you going to uh, police station? They said, you must come in. I said, why? Uh, what happened? You can't tell me. They told me, okay, you came to... Police station, we do the explain everything to you. Yeah, so it's the second time you've second been time. detained from our police in the police station. Yes. How long? Oh my goodness, that time is very bad time. Seven uh, hours. Uh, seven hours. Uh, you told me that you were so scared because yeah. there were so many put you in the car. How many there were? Oh. Uh, three in the car. Me and Mustafa is five in the car. It's yeah. very bad uh, talk to us. Yeah, and the police, the, uh, and the police outside is undercover. Yeah, is more people. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, why? What crime you did? <laughs> yeah. I don't know. But, what crime? Oh, I know. My crime is. I want to see my daughter. My daughter leave this country, but nobody give an answer to me. But well, how can see my daughter? Please, you exactly, tell me. Exactly, exactly. That day, we have a meeting with the Soko Shady. In the entire that, that day. Yeah, I, I, I know that. It's Wednesday. Exactly that day, we have a meeting. I said, I have a meeting. I must go. Where are you going? Where are you go? Why you have a meeting? Meeting for who? I said, I don't, I, I don't want to ask you where I'm a meeting. Because, you know, they know that. Where I'm so, not going. So they knew that you are going to meet this uh, Mr. No. Sokol Shady yes. and uh, they sabotage you. <laughs> they yes. kept you in the police station, so they didn't meet him that day. 8.30 to, to um, 50 minutes to 3 o'clock, I mistake. After no. After. No water, no, nothing. But uh, she did And talk. translation? No, nothing. Nothing? Not nothing. And you are saying to them that you are Canadian citizen, why you are yeah. They know everything. They, they, they take it out. Uh, my passport. Passport and telephone too. And, they uh, check uh, everything. They check They, they took everything. your personal yes. data. Personal and telephone. They, uh, uh, and uh, we have security. You go inside. He, he asked me how uh, open the security because we said, okay, his policeman, uh, they must check you everything. You got scared? We are yeah. scared. We are my scared. telephone is uh, stop it because it's a war on the phone. That yeah. doesn't have a open it. Yeah. And they going with the Mustafa to the went to the hotel and take the the okay. car to open it. The, tell my telephone. Did did they harm you physically? Did they beat you or no, no, beat no, you no, or something? Not no. just uh, talking. But psychologically, yes. psychologically, very bad. No uh, translation. No lawyers. Nothing. But most of us go to the third floor. I am staying in the first floor. Separated rooms. Yeah, separated. separated. But no I water, no food, nothing. 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 <laughs> but, but so, said, like you know, criminals. Yeah, it's yeah, it's like criminals. They take it me. I'm saying, so, what happened to me? I am me? very nervous. I have a meeting with Sako uh, Shady. I am very bad situation like that. But they said, I said, most of I want to talk to my husband. Where is my husband? They said, shh. It's very bad. The police took a, the police okay. talk to me. It's very bad. Very bad. Even yes. you are a woman. Yes. But she, uh, she she's sick. She, she has heart pressure. She has diabetes. Yeah. She has uh, cholesterol. She has everything. But uh, uh, that time uh, uh, she don't. She needed her medicine. Uh, medicine, but the, 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 nobody uh, listened to us. But so Albanian police is abusing with you. Yes. It's not protecting you. No, yeah. no, no, no. They're using us. Okay, uh, so do you think that the Albanian authorities are going to help you later? On I'm Norway? thinking. I'm thinking the government Albania help us. First, we went to minister. We asked them, please, do. we want to just see my daughter. Right. So police is not helping you. Nothing. And is following you all the time. You are saying to me, this person is after us all the time. Yeah, this it's, person is after us all the time. Yeah, they come and they follow us. <laughs> I have been with you uh, these two days and I've seen them coming after you, next to you all the time. Always they come in, 24 hours. But, but what about Canadian Embassy? 
I because you are a Canadian citizen. How can they dare and abuse I don't two know. Canadian uh, citizens? We don't know any law in the Did you contact Canada. them? Uh, yeah, I went to the uh, embassy, but the uh, uh, Canada embassy, I'm talking. Consulate uh, yeah, that we, they have uh, here? Uh, yeah, I'm said we are here, uh, we come in, uh, uh, we wanted to see uh, uh, my daughter. Yeah. But uh, they said, okay. But I uh, said to them, uh, is the Canadian embassy, please do help me. They said, uh, we cannot help you because your daughter is not citizen of Canada. I said, my daughter that time... Uh, but you are Canadian. But I am yes. Canadian uh, citizenship. Uh, 25 years I'm living in the Canada. Thanks God, we don't have any criminal or we don't have any problem. Uh, I am 62 years old, uh, you know? Yeah. But uh, uh, doesn't give it any they, answer. They refuse to help. Yes. Because your daughter is not being Canadian. Yeah, it's not Canadian. But uh, I'm... Uh, anyway... So what not... is your... Uh, what do you think? Why Albanian government is afraid from two parents, two simple persons, that they are getting old now and they're, they're missed and they are getting tired fighting for their daughter and they are suffered so much for their daughter. Why do you think Albanian government is afraid from you and abuse with uh, you so much? Really, I cannot tell anything about uh, Albania and Albania government. They have a government, I am not involved with the Albanian government. But Albanian, maybe they did it uh, American. Yeah. And Israel and Arab Saudi, they did it business together. They bring it all Mujahideen here. Yeah. And bring my daughter here. But I am not about, care about the business. You don't care about politics. Political, anything. This is their job. Their job is not my job. Yeah. But I wanted to ask the government, Albania, please, just you bring my daughter. We want to see my daughter just one time. There's so many that time went to Mojahedin, 16 years Why old. they stop the, uh, you to, to meet your daughter? Why mean. Mac is afraid of you? Because if Anybody, yeah. everybody in the Mujahideen, they see family, they support her, they come in, never come back to Mujahideen. And America don't want it, Somalia they come in. Then now, is Somalia is famous on the world, and everybody knows her name. Her name. Because you, you made a, a, a peaceful uh, uh, campaign. Campaign, every, campaign, everything, everywhere. You said to me that you have been even in church here in Albania. Yeah, I went to church. But after, uh, you know why? Why you went in church? Because after uh, me and my wife, we went uh, to minister. I'm asked minister. I went to the UN. I went to Ramsa. But we knocked door everywhere. Yeah. And ask the people in the Albany, please, how can I help And you are wearing these shirts in the street. Yeah, yeah. on the shirt. And they what do they, uh, the Albanians? The people, Albanian, is very nice people. It's yeah. very Simple good people. people. Yeah. I love the Albanian people. They said, we don't know how can I help you. Can you tell me how, what uh, or how can I help you? I said, just pray for us. But then you, you decided to go in church, yeah. why? I'm said uh, for my wife. I am Muslim, alhamdulillah. Yeah. But I am not, uh, I believe for all people. We, uh, I'm said uh, in this Sunday we went to church. We went to church. And a small church. Yeah. Here okay. in Tirana. Yeah, in the Tirana. It's very close to my hotel site. Mm -hmm. We went there. I am uh, saw in the past. I uh, said, today, I went everywhere, knocked the door. The people, government, Albania helped me. Nobody helped us. Just today, I came here. We asked you and that people live here. But he asked me, who came first time in the church? But I said, he came here. But he said, why you came here? I said, I have some reason. I want to tell you. And you told them their yeah, your I said, story. I said my history to them. Everybody is crying. 
Go there, ask them. I went there, they said, oh, sorry, we cannot do it, help you. We cannot do it, anything. So, Mabuba, if you see your daughter, what are you going to tell her? <laughs> oh, my God. I'm just, I want her to kiss her. I love you. I love you. I love you, my daughter. Your mother, <laughs> my you ask this question. It's very hard. <laughs> just, I want to see my daughter. <laughs> Oh my god! I can't! I can't! Yeah, this is hard. I know it's very hard for you. For me too. 30 years! 30 years! I don't know why it doesn't. Even getting it, my daughter just here, everywhere, just what I want to see. My daughter! Why doesn't. You cannot see my daughter! Why? I don't know, I don't know where I'm going, we don't know, for who, we don't know anything, the God knows, we don't know, we're going everywhere, we knock the door, please, the people help us, my, I have three ch ch children in the Canada, I was the Canadian, we cannot escape it. So you are a, a very good testimony, what the, this organization is making to you is terrifying you is keeping your daughter as a hostage and not the letting hostage. her to come out and she's uh, being uh, like in jail in that more camp. than jail i want to tell you i want to tell you the mojahedin they wanted against how many regime and mullah regime in iran you go to iran you can go in the camera on the jail the family, they go see the family. people, family. But the Mojo, they doesn't give it permit. <laughs> yeah. They so. doesn't give it permit for father, mother, or sister, brother, the sister, his wife. Why doesn't give it? Escape for what? If if your uh, daughter was in Iran, kept but by Homene, you can you can meet her. Yes. Now she, she's his mother, his mother. His mother, uh, more mother. than twenty five, uh, two years and uh, two two years and six months was on the jail. Yeah. Every week That's she true. went to uh, see mother and brother in the jail. Every week. So that country that this organization is saying that is not democratic is, <laughs> is being more democratic with the people than this organization pretending to be democracy. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, uh, I hope, I really hope I was testimony today with you when this organization, this criminal organization and me too as an Albanian citizen, I was very surprised to see that we together, we are trying to fix a meeting, an appointment with Mr. Sokolche in the Interior Ministry. And uh, they, they told us that you cannot see him because he is busy. He, don't have, he doesn't have any information about your daughter. And when we came back again to ask another question, we found there three uh, members of uh, Mujahideen. Mujahideen. And I'm really surprised. I didn't expect that in my country, these people that are here uh, to, to attack me, and they are uh, not even letting me a place to sit first because they are watching me like angry. Even they don't know what I'm doing there. Even I am Albanian, I'm not... I am a lawyer, I'm not doing anything wrong. I am my country, I have 
full my rights and these people are coming in my country they are meeting my exactly <laughs> the, the persons that I pay they they take taxes from me I pay them their salary is being paid by me by Albanian citizens and this organization these terrorists that keeping hostage this your daughter and other members there they attacked us they blamed us we dare to film this and uh, I, I I will follow all the, the legal steps to complain about this what they did to me and to you today and I feel really sorry that our government is being so much corrupt to be on the side of terrorists to be on the side of these people who keep as hostage to these people who separate families like you who destroy the life of people, not letting them to have the right of free movement, to have the right of free decision for their life and to, to have a freedom to decide for their life. And I'm very sorry that my government is helping this organization, including some famous politician as uh, Pandeli Maiko, Elona Gebrea, and some other people that last month they went to Paris to support this this criminal organization and I'm gonna write to them I'm gonna complain to them what is their opinion because they just dream to eat an ice cream in free Iran and what is their opinion to eat an ice cream inside the mat with their daughter not letting her to see her parents what is Pandeli Michael saying what is this government saying what is this police doing to these poor parents? I hope Albanian people understand all this. I hope some organizations will uh, move. My word was said even to Brussels with uh, two deputies the, uh, there. And I'm going to write to them again and again about you and your daughter. And I really hope that we will do our best to help you. And even with uh, uh, to, to use all legal uh, methods and all legal ways to help you, even including Canadian government and American government, maybe if they will dare to, to help uh, or to, to put human rights first and then politics. Thank you so much for being am, here. I am, thank you. Uh, but now, just I want to ask. The people of Albania, please, please help for please my help. family. Please help. Just please, we want to see my daughter, my daughter in the Tirana. Please, please. I don't know how I can tell you. We are father and mother. I am 62 years old. I don't know how long can I live. Please. We, we, hope, we hope you're going to see your daughter. We'll do our, all our best to, to find a way yeah, for you, you. To, to say. Okay. Thank you, uh, thank you so much. Yeah, I'm are, sorry. Thank you. I'm very sorry. Really sorry. Let's pray Allah. Let's pray God that help us in our way to, to find your daughter. Kevin Brito no fund you fall under the proof of money and express him to the person who. Nu kuptoj në anglisht të gjenjë më mërë për të kuptuar rastin ne do të sensibilizëm edhe media të tjera edhe do të përdorim edhe rrugë të tjera që historinë e këture dy prinderve të gjorë të cilët kanë mbi 20 vjetë që nuk e shikojnë vajzën e tyre që mbajt për nga kjo organizat dhe urojmë që politikanët tanë të cilët e mbështesin ajtë shumë demokracinë të mbështesin atë realisht dhe të kuptojnë se nëse kjo organizat është vërtet demokratike apo jo dhe të kuptojnë apo të mos lejojnë, të pengojnë dhe të ndihmojnë gjdo familje, gjdo person i cilë do të takohet me familjen e ti. Mos të pengojnë të drejtën më themelore të njeriut që është e drejta për të patur një familje. Dhe shpresojmë që autoritete shqiptare do të ndërhynë edhe do të sigurojnë që të pak të në këta prinder të kontaktojnë bion e tyre të mbajtur pengë edhe të të privuar nga liria e takimit me prindrit e saj. Ju falenderoj shumë për fëmëndjen të akohemi në emisionet e tjera. Nga unë Migina, selam alegu më rafatullë. Thank you.
So you are taking the Mujahideens, you are not taking Albanian lawyers to defend abducted Canadian citizens, right? So you are defending these people against... No, I want to take photographs and you no, cannot yeah, stop me. The I'm taking this photograph for the Canadian government no, no, to prove you. how you are abducting uh, people and how the Albanian uh, government and police are helping you to abduct Canadian citizens. Yes, doesn't give a permit to me. And here are their parents. Speak, yeah. speak. And here are their parents who want to take information about their daughter. Yes. What is your name, sir? My name is Mustafa Mohammadi and my mother is... What is going on? Why you are here? We came here just we want to see my daughter, Soma Mohammed. All right. And why they are not receiving you here? Uh, doesn't give a permit to me. And yeah. whom do they give permit to? Uh, here. Here doesn't give an answer to us. All right. And who are these people who entered? This is the member is of the Arab uh, organization. Are they the people who have taken your daughter? Yeah, they are, they are no damages. All right. They are the Mojahedin Arab organization. All right. Thank you.